Erebos. This looks like this is just clean up in game four. Yeah, and keep in mind here, Ben Freeman donating all of his winnings in this tournament to Mariah Palioko and her fund. So good on him. So it just looks like you mentioned, kind of mop up duty here. A fast desecration demon, very good against blue devotion and particularly against an opponent who can't cast spells. All right, and Ben just making sure the coast is clear of Thossies. And this is the hand that Logan had kept. Looks like he kept a land light hand. Many Thassas, Night Veil Spectres, Biden. A lot of cards that are very good against the black white midrange deck. But of course, not in your hand. Yeah, uh, you have to cast them. You see some, some discards in the yard for Logan. He had some Cloudfin Raptors early on in the game, so he wasn't without early damage. But looks like Ben's going to go ahead and get this. A 3-3 was made here. Ben finally getting some damage across. It's going to put him down to Logan down to 13. All right, so walk me through this. If Logan gets to stack his deck every turn, he just instead of drawing he demonic tutors. Nope. Can, can he? OK. Nope. Can't we, win. We've passed the point. I'm, I'm inclined to agree that even doing that every turn isn't enough. And there you have it, Logan, not even in the land there. Offers the concession three games to one. Ben Friedman is on to the semis where he will face up against Jared Betcher. Congratulations to Ben Friedman. Logan Mize, a great weekend. Probably the least recognizable name, uh, the shortest resume, but a great weekend with Mono Blue Devotion. And Ben Friedman, again, the, the, the young man donating all of his winnings to charity here. Moving on to the semifinals. Still un unblemished in the standard portion. Yeah, now moving to 9-0. and oh. Great weekend for Logan Mize, his first big finish. This is a pretty good one to have at that. And Absol at the absolutely. Yeah, nothing to be ashamed of there. And it looked like he, you know, he won game one. and. and